Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm sharing an Animal Crossing merch haul with you. This is in partnership with Zen Market, a shopping service that can help you purchase goods from Japan even if the shop or seller doesn't ship outside of Japan. For info on how to shop through Zen Market, check out the links in the description below. Okay, let's get started. So the first item I have here is this Nintendo Switch case. I picked up this design because it's a little bit different from um, most of the pink stuff that I normally pick up, but I really like the autumnal colors. I feel like it's really perfect for the season that we're in. It's a really simple case. It just has a flip cover that goes over the screen and two silicon um, Joy-Con covers. So here are the silicon Joy-Con covers. They're super cute. They have a pattern printed all over the front and like little grippy things on the back. And I really like these because they're super easy to install. You just slip them over your Joy-Cons. And here is the cover itself. It's full of really adorable artwork of the characters. And I like the quilt pattern. Like I said, it's pretty different from a lot of the Animal Crossing stuff I already own. And as you can see, there's little slots for all the buttons. So to install it, you just kind of clip it on over your screen and it will snap into place. And you're done. Super cute. You can access your screen like that and then for the covers you just kind of fit them on and i like how they cover most of the joy con as well and you can still get access to all of the buttons very easily so yeah super adorable i really like this one and i like the little logo they have on the back too i think it's a nice touch So the next item I have here is this Switch stand. So you might have seen this online, I think it came out a few months ago. This is from Hori and I really like this because the design is so adorable. And the stand is also in white, which is a bit different. A lot of stands usually come in darker colors, most of the time black. Um, it is made of plastic, but I didn't feel like it felt flimsy at all. The print is very cute, it kind of reminds me of the old school like Pop-Tart design. And then it also has a big leaf emblem. And you can adjust it to three heights so you just kind of prop it up against those little tabs at the bottom and it has this little stand part for your switch to rest on like that next are these really adorable game card cases so i have one in the evil sisters pattern and one featuring kk and isabel and when i first saw these online i thought they were so cute and i love how you can carry both 3ds and switch cards in the same case and i'll show you how that works but here's a little close-up you can see it has really adorable prints and then to add in the switch card case you just slide it into the slot like that but you can pop out the other slot and add in your 3ds card so i thought that was super cool and also nice because like what if you want to play animal crossing new horizons and new leaf now you can bring both of them with you i think the flip top is just such a cute mechanism too i haven't really seen any game card cases like this and of course i picked up some thumbstick covers i have a lot of these so i won't really open them up to show you but they do have the leaf pattern the new horizons leaf pattern and then finally i have this tote bag this is probably my favorite item in the haul. I love this. As soon as I saw it come out and I saw all the pictures online, I really wanted to own it and it's pretty big. You can see here it has pockets for both the Switch and the Switch Lite so you can use it regardless of whichever console you have. So here's the tote bag and I love the coloring. It's pale kind of like seafoam green and it has that pop-tart pattern on it and it's made of like a canvas material. It feels very sturdy actually, and it's quite large. I can't even fit it all into the frame of my camera, but that's okay. You can see here the texture of the canvas pattern, and that's a pocket right there too. The zipper is this leaf pattern, which I think is so cute. And then here's the pocket for my actual switch. But as you can see, you can't actually place the switch with the Joy-Cons attached. You have to remove the Joy-Cons, which is something I find that a lot of cases from Japan actually require you to do. But once you take them off, it fits perfectly and you can close it up with a Velcro. And then you can place the Joy-Cons themselves in the little mesh pocket, which is here on the other side of the bag. And they fit perfectly. They're quite spacious pockets, so you shouldn't have any trouble. And there's still a ton of room for carrying a bunch of other stuff in the bag aside from your Switch and your Joy-Cons and stuff, so this might actually become my everyday bag. I love it, it's so cute. 
All right, so here's everything I got in my Zen Market Animal Crossing haul. I really love everything, but I think my favorite item has to be the tote bag. It's so cute. Let me know in the comment section below which items were your favorites. And of course, thank you to Zen Market for partnering with me for this video. I will have links in the description to show you guys how to make use of their service and everything like that. As always, thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, be sure to like and subscribe, and I will see you next time. Bye!